join him, but to beat him. Roger and Jed, he's our man, hero of our nation. For his adventures, just be sure and stay tuned to this station. So come and join us, all you kids, for lots of fun and laughter. As Roger and Jed and his men get all the crooks they're after. Roger and Jed, he's our man, hero of our nation. For his adventures, just be sure and stay tuned to this station. As this erratic episode begins, we find the United States Forestry Department in a goodly amount of trouble. Sir, I think you should be made aware of a problem. You're going to tell me about a problem? I've been cooped up in this mush. You're going to look out tower for three months. Ha, ha, ha. I'll tell you about a problem. Yes, sir, but it's about our trees. Trees? What about the trees? Why, well, the woods are full of them. The woods were full of them, sir. They're disappearing. They're being pilfered, stolen, swiped. And strange as it sounded, that's exactly what was happening. One by one, every tree in the forest was being taken. Gentlemen, I have here a report on our trees. Oh, boy, could I read it while you're through? No, you never return anything. I do, too. Oh, yeah? Where's that nifty report I gave you on maple syrup sap, huh? Where's that one? What'd you do with that one, smart guy? I hate you. Anyway, this report says all our trees are being stolen. If something isn't done about it soon, our nation will be completely treeless, and you know what that means. Yeah, Bambi wouldn't have no place to live at. Call Roger Ramjet. Roger Ramjet! Not like that. I meant on the telephone. <laughs> Roger Woodman, spare that tree, Ramjet reporting, sir. That's wonderful. Ramjet, we need your help again, probably. Get out there and find what's happening to our trees, then put a stop to it. Immediately. <coughs> Hello, good rangers. How's it all going, tree-wise? Poorly. Just look around. Hmm, nothing left of the tree but this huge hole. Right. Then, suddenly... <coughs> <coughs> So that was it. A gigantic bear was behind the tree snatching. Now all Roger had to figure out was, how do I get out of here without having my foot eaten off? And how to stop the bear. I got it. Why don't you talk that bear, Roger? I'll say you've got it and it's affecting your brain. Are you crazy? I'm not going down there. <laughs> Hello there, Bear. Now listen, you don't know me, but I got... A lot of fellows at the government kind of elected me to talk to you about this tree eating. Now, they want you to stop, you see, and... Hmm. I don't like the looks of this. Well, I don't know what this bear is up to, but I've got to get out of here. The best way to do that is to take one of my proton energy pills. They give me the strength of 20 atom bombs for a period of 20 seconds. There. Well, that's it. He's a circus bear. And he escaped? That's right, he's... Never been in the woods before, and he doesn't know what to eat in the wilds. That's why he's destroying your trees. Just take me to him. I can stop him. Uh, mm, ah. Oh. There you are, gentlemen. The problem is solved, and the threat to our forests is eliminated. Thanks to me, Roger Ramjet, fearless all-American hero type. Ramjet, you fool. That is a very priceless bear. If you've hurt him, I'll have you arrested. Yeah, Ramjet, you big bully, picking up poor defenseless creatures in the forest like this. You should be ashamed of yourself. <laughs> Come on, Bruno. Mm. Did the mean man hurt my baby? Mm -hmm. That's better. Come on, sweetie. <laughs> Being a hero can be a lonely existence at times. And so Roger Ramjet has done it again. Saved our national forests from ruin and beaten the fur out of a poor little defenseless bear. The bully. When Ramjet takes a proton pill, the crooks begin to worry. They can't escape their For his adventures, just be sure and stay tuned to the station. So come and join us, all you kids, for lots of fun and laughter. As Roger Ramjet and his men get all the crooks they're after. Roger Ramjet, he's our man, hero of our nation. For his adventures.
adventures, just be sure and stay tuned to this 